guys, I am back from TechGeeks.com with a pair of Bluetooth headphones. They are model CX04. Uh, they're from my friends at Kulex. Um, these offer a lot of features for under 16 bucks. I actually had a little bit of a complaint until I saw how much they cost, so my complaint's gone. Of course, they are not Bose headphones. Just get that. They're not Beats. They're not whatever you want. These are basically really good for uh, stuff around the house, driving in the car. Uh, you know, I wouldn't go all hardcore and play your best bass music through them. I mean, they're just not for that. I love them because they go around your neck. Um... I like that convenience. They have magnetic ends on them, so the little buds automatically flip into the uh, headphones themselves. Um, the built-in mic I thought worked really well. I used it to answer a few calls. And I had uh, nice call clarity, my end and their end. I used them on iOS. Uh, I think it was an iPhone 6S, I believe. And I used them on a Android phone, which was a Galaxy S7. No problems. Uh, like I said, they have um, their Bluetooth 4.1, which I like. They have CVC 6.0, which I really like for connectivity. Uh, noise cancellation, um, they're, it, it worked very well for both. I had no issues whatsoever with either one. Ten hours of playback time I thought was really good. And like I said, these are only $15.99. So a lot of these features you're not getting with even, say, $24 headphones. But... Either way, these are a very good price for a very good sounding headphone. Very good for calls. Uh, the hands-free, like I said, worked absolutely perfect. Uh, let's bring up a few of their pictures. Um, the charging port, I did have an issue with that. As you can see, it is buried. They need to put a little tab on there. I, I That bugged me. And... Uh, these do have an on and off switch, which I'm very happy with. Uh, I, I don't get a lot of headphones that have the on and off switch. There it is right there. I love this, because I like to leave my stuff... I, uh, whenever I take it off, I like to just take it off and forget about it. And half the time I'm still paired to something, and it just turns into a rigor remote that I don't need. I like these. Click the power off, and you're done. <laughs> simple as that um, there's your charging port on this side as I said the other side is a little uh, charging port LED indicator power switches over there um, microphone is on one side volume next and track is on the it's underneath that silver button it's right there and how it works is you long press for um, the volume and just press once plus or minus whichever way you want to go for your tracks uh, a single press will get you to the next track and a long press will get your volume uh, these do talk to you so they are voice uh, so it tells you when you're at max volume and powered on and paired and all that good stuff um, let's see what else we got here uh, impressive 12 hours of music playback time, 450 hours of standby time. Like I said, I got around 10, so I'm not, maybe I'm a little bit off, or they're off. I actually could have written, sworn I just read it was 10 hours, but that's what I got, 10 hours. Uh, it says here 10 hours of playtime. Over here it says 12 hours of playtime. So, I don't know, maybe they need to fix that. But, anyways. Um, there you go, so you can wear them right around your neck. Just pop the ends out. Like I said, that's your end right there, the bud. That's the magnetic end. There she has her hands on them. Uh, these, are, this is for answering calls. That silver button. Um, 
normal plastic materials. It's like an ABS plastic. Uh, it's got a, see, they have a, it's almost, it feels like ABS, but they say there's a silicone material on it. I don't really feel it, so, um, there's the CSR, the CBC, the built-in mic, and your signal. Um, there's the ends, how they look when they come out. Like I said, they just magnetically go right back into right there. There you can see that they're out. Obviously, they're right here. But you can see that's where they pop back in. Uh, there's some things you can do with them. Running, jogging, whatever the heck you want. Driving them in the car. Uh, here's everything you get. You get uh, three sets of buds, the little ends. Uh, mine came with a medium on there. And there is a small, medium, and large. Uh, your charging cable, which is going to be the USB, micro USB uh, to USB-A. Uh, a gift certificate, or, uh, uh, I mean, a really good user's manual. And actually, how everything's presented in the box, I thought was second to none. I thought it would look like a high-class headphones, expensive-wise. Uh, they did a really good job packaging. Everything was there. Everything's nice, neat, tidy. Uh, I like that. I'm kind of ADD like that. But anyways, these were pretty good. I really liked them. I thought the price was great. I gave them probably a four stars. Uh, I had no issues with calls. I had a little bit of issue playing music through Pandora with them cutting out a little bit here and there, but that could be my Bluetooth. It might not be the headphones. I didn't have that issue on iOS, so I take it for I don't I don't knock a star off or anything like that. I thought the build quality was where I knocked the star off. I thought they felt cheap, um, but they are excuse me fifteen ninety nine so. I don't have no problem with anything. Um, Built-in mic worked fine. Calls worked fine. Noise cancellation was fine. Uh, I didn't have them slipping in and out of my ears. Anything like that. So uh, They're definitely worth a look. It's from my friends at Kulax. Uh, I will put a link to the product on Amazon.com in the video description. So look down below. And uh, I will do a little bit of a hands-on demo, show you how to pair them and whatnot, what you're going to be looking for to pair them. And that's going to be in the hands-on portion, which is about to start right now. And that would be the box that you're going to get them in. As I said, it kind of looks like a gift box. Got the Kulax name right on there. Nothing else but uh, their name on the back, Sport Wireless Headphones. Uh, probably looks like a model number there, an ROH safety thing there, recycle box, love that. And then inside is what they're going to look like this. Obviously the headphones are going to be in here. You're going to get this little gifty boxy CX04, which is the model number, is going to be in there. So I love the presentation, thought it was cool. Okay, after that you're going to open them up. You're going to get one of these, two of these little baggies. One's going to have this guy in it, which is your USB charging cable. Other one's going to have some extra ends, some earbuds. that are going to look like these guys right here. You're going to get a small, medium, and large. I believe medium comes on the headphones themselves. Put that away. Get to the good stuff. You're going to get a really good CX-04 user's manual. It's going to have everything. I love the black pages. More people need to do this. Uh, you're going to get some specs on there. Bluetooth 4.0 operation. Bluetooth is class 2. Uh, A2DP and AVRCP. Uh, that's the Bluetooth. Uh, talk time up to 12 hours. Playback time is 10 hours. Oh, that was the difference on the website review. Okay, I see what they're saying. Talk time is 12 hours, play time is 10 hours. I got about 10 hours playing them with music and making like four phone calls I think I made. Uh, but everything's covered in this. Nice bold print, I love it. Pair them, how to pair them, what you're looking for when you pair them. You're going to be looking for a Kulak CX-04 on your device. I will show you that in a minute. Uh, basically everything's there. LED status. Uh, we all know pair mode is the red and, uh, excuse me, blue flashing. They turn blue when they're paired, etc., etc., etc. 
Now, let's get to my gripes. The one thing I did not like is that guy right there. It's very hard to open the USB charging port. In fact, I had to get one of these little stickies to pop it open. So, Kulax, if you're listening, please put a little flap on there to open this. Be much appreciated. But anyways, that is where you are going to charge. And make sure you close it up. But see, it's kind of hard to open. So this is the headphones themselves. You can see they are plastic. Uh, there is like a silicone around this. That I like. It's great for sweating. It's great for comfort. Now the buds themselves are in these ends. You can see. I'll pop out one of them. Pop. It's got a magnetic little guy on there. And they just suck right back in. So you'll take them out, pop them in your ears, and you're good to go. As I said, I think these are medium ends. They might be small, actually. I don't know. Uh, there's no right and left that I saw, I don't think. No, there is not. So basically, when you're done, you got them around your neck. Just pop them back in. Simple as that. I like that. Great for mowing the lawn. Pop them in and out. Somebody wants to talk to you, just set them around your neck. Um, as far as button controls go, there's only one side that's active as far as the silver bars go. Uh, it's this side, the same side with their Kulak's name on it. Same side as the power button, which I loved right there, on and off. Love it. Um, also on that side, you got your plus and minus Hit it once, track skips, hold it, volume up or down. You got uh, an LED indicator. Uh, in fact, I think my music just turned on by itself because I was pressing the buttons. But anyways, in fact, let me turn them off and we'll pair them for you guys. There, They flash red when they're pairing off too. So you get an LED indicator right there if you can see it. Uh, microphone on the outside also the only thing excuse that phone call the only thing you're gonna be doing on this side is charging and that is right there that is it everything else is done from one side which I usually use that side as my right side that's up to you uh, you get a call you can press this to answer the call uh, track skip like I said up and down volume up and down long press is for the volume one click is for the track skip and I will grab my phone and show you some Bluetooth connectivity here um, there they are right there Kulax so I will turn the speakers actually on and you'll see that I am connected for a call and audio. So it's simple as that for pairing them. Mine were already paired, so it's even easier for mine. They pair automatically. But you can see how fast they paired, which also I really liked. Um, you can go in there and change some stuff, whatever you want to do there. Uh, call audio or media. You can turn either one off, even unpair them. So it's simple as that. You're looking for Kulax CX04, and you'll be good to go. They they pair very fast. I really enjoyed that. Um, I liked how the ends pop in, the buds themselves, and that's all you do as far as popping those in. Once you get the cord out of the way, there you go. So there you go. I like the comfort of them. Uh, slot sound quality was definitely up to par for a uh, under $20 pair of headphones, or under $17, I think under $16 actually. But pretty much everything works. Really enjoyed them. Only thing I did not like was that charging port. Needs to have a little flap on it. There's kind of one there, but barely. But there's kind of a little thing you can get your fingernail in there. You can see it. I don't like it. So. It eh, wouldn't affect it being around your neck if they had just a little bit of a rubber piece there to pop that off. But 
not a big gripe so like I said I gave them four stars I like them check them out on amazon.com follow the link in my video description and you can check out more of my reviews on techgeeks.com that's t-e-c-k-e geeks.com uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you could please I do tons of giveaways and you don't want to miss out on them and we announce all our giveaways and product discounts through YouTube so if you subscribe you're gonna know about it if you don't you won't so that's up to you I will see you guys on the next one and thank you to my friends at Kulaks have a good day.